Hey guys, how you doing? This is Rich from Rich TV Live. And today I want to speak to you a little bit about Pure Extracts Technologies Corp. So I've been marking this up since it was at its IPO. And you can see that since IPO day, it exploded when as high as just under 90 cents, which was an amazing sell zone. Obviously, right when it started was the buy zone. It went up, created an incredible sell zone, almost 100% right off the bat. And then it dipped, created another buy opportunity, ripped, created another sell opportunity, dipped, created another buy opportunity, ripped, created another sell opportunity. And now it's having this dip again, and it's a very aggressive dip. And at some point, you got to think that this trend is going to turn around because it's been trending down for quite some time and creating, in my opinion, potentially another buy zone. But that remains to be seen. Obviously, the market has been giving back a lot of its gains that it has achieved over the last few months. And especially small cap stocks that have been up a lot are now giving back gains. Now, if you're part of our trading club, we were literally telling everybody, guys, markets are at all time highs. In January, we were killing it, having amazing success and saying, guys, lock in profits, get in cash, get at least 50% cash. Markets are all time highs. We could see a correction. The markets are still all-time highs. We haven't really seen a correction on the broader markets, but with small caps, we're starting to see a lot of small caps giving back a lot of their earlier gains. Now, what I want to focus on when the market starts getting very choppy and companies start giving back gains, we want to focus on fundamentals. We want to focus on revenue. We want to focus on share structure, and we want to focus on news. So one of the companies that we've talked about a lot is Pure Extracts. Now, one of the reasons why Pure Extracts has been struggling is that they are in the psychedelic space and they are in the cannabis space, two spaces that have both been struggling. So you can see that they are doing exactly like all their peers are doing. They've had some upside and now they're really struggling to get to higher levels. As an investor, you're always looking to buy something when it's down. But the key is you don't want to get it you know, you don't want to catch a falling knife and buy something if it continues to go down. So you want to be very careful. Now, remember, Rich TV Live is strictly for education, entertainment purposes. Always do your due diligence. Always do your research before you invest in anything that we talk about here in Rich TV Live. Everything that we talk about is for informational and educational purposes. And consult a financial advisor before you consider investing in anything that we talk about here in Rich TV Live. These are sponsored videos. Pure Extracts purchases over 500 kgs of dry flour to prepare for retail launch of vapes and gummies. So these guys are just preparing, getting ready. This is more news in anticipation of the launch. Pure Extracts Technologies Corp. Pull in Canada, P-U-L-L, P-R-X-T-F in America, and A-2-Q-J-A-J in Frankfurt, Germany. A plant-based extraction company focused on cannabis, hemp, functional mushrooms, and the rapidly emerging psychedelic sector is pleased to announce it has purchased over 500 kgs of high potency dry cannabis flour in preparation for the launch next month of retail sales of its pure poles, vapes, and pure chews edible gummies. So we are literally one month away. Will this be the bottom for pure extracts? Demand for these types of products is strong in the four provinces, British Columbia, Alberta, Saskatchewan, and Ontario. And the company is targeting for its retail launch and revenue estimates associated with the shipment are just over $1 million. So that will be really a big catalyst for the company, in my opinion, their first million dollars in revenues. Pure Extract CEO Ben Nikoleski remarked, Q2 is going to be very exciting for us as we commence retail sales of vapes and gummies through our distribution partner. Our exceptionally pure products are in high demand, and we have a range in potencies and flavors that consumers will certainly enjoy. About Pure Extracts, Pure Extracts features an all-new state-of-the-art processing facility located just 20 minutes north of world-famous Whistler, British Columbia. The bespoke facility has been constructed to European Union GMP standards, aiming towards expert sales of products and formulations, including those currently restricted in Canada into European jurisdictions where they are legally available on September 25th, 2020. Pure Extracts was granted its standard processing license by Health Canada under the Cannabis Act and the company stock began trading on the Canadian Securities Exchange CSE on November 5th, 2020. So this is big news. What do you think of this news? If you like the news, smash the like button, comment down below, share the video everywhere and subscribe. Do you think 
that this is the bottom now for pure extracts. Have we finally found the bottom? I know that we've had some big runs up, big runs down. Is this finally the bottom? It's literally as low as it's ever been. Do we go any lower than this? Or is this finally the bottom and do we climb from here? That's the million dollar question. Love to know what you guys think. This is your boy Rich from Rich to be live. If you're not winning, you're not watching. We bring in the winners and we bring them to you first. And we identify buy zone, sell zones. And I think that this might be really, I mean, when you look at the chart, it clearly looks like it's near the bottom, but who knows? I mean, psychedelic stocks have been drifting down. Cannabis stocks have been drifting down. Will this continue? That remains to be seen. Love to know what you guys think. I think this is pretty big news for poll. It hasn't really been responding to news. Feels to me like the market wants to see the revenue hit the balance sheet. And I believe we are literally a month away from seeing the revenue hit the balance sheet. So let me know what you guys think. This is your boy, Rich, from Rich to be live with news from Pure Extracts. Pure Extracts purchases over 500 kgs of dry flour to prepare for retail launch of vapes and gummies and anticipating a shipment of over $1 million. That's right. This is your boy, Rich, from Rich to be live. Bring you the winners, bring you the news, and bring it to you first from Pure Extracts. And I'm out. Peace. Have we found the bottom? Kind of looks like it. Sure looks like it. We go up from here. We'd want to see this trend up here. And if we got in here from 46 to 88 zone where it's been, it'd be almost 100% return. So we'll see. I'm out.